Mass News digging deeper into a local story that's received national attention. Last week, police say a Holyoke kindergartner was found with a packet of cocaine at school. They say that school officials called police immediately when the child told them tasting the powder made him feel like a superhero. While police say the child is okay, his father facing drug charges, some say the issue highlights a bigger problem in Holyoke. Western Mass News reporter Audrey Russo joins us live from our downtown studio with more. Audrey. The kindergartner's father is facing reckless endangerment of a child charge a reckless endangerment of a child charge in addition to those drug charges you guys mentioned. Police are telling us that they found packets and baggies of heroin and cocaine in the family's Essex Street apartment. Now, when it comes to one Holyoke City Councilor, he says Essex Street is a notorious area for illegal activity. This is a tragedy for the young child. Hopefully he's going to be getting counseling. Uh, this is a traumatic incident in his life. Holyoke City Councilor Terry Murphy represents Ward 2, encompassing H.B. Lawrence School. He says hearing about a kindergartner coming to school with cocaine is just the latest in complaints and problems he's received about the surrounding community. This is a, an area right now that is a major problem in the city. He spoke with Western Mass News on Essex Street, where the child's father, Benny Garcia, was arrested. Inside their apartment, police say they found packets and bags of cocaine and heroin. Since the start of the year, Holyoke police tell Western Mass News there have been 17 arrests on the 145 Essex Street block, saying most were drug or gang related. Murphy says he believes landlords need more resources to report possible illegal activity of their tenants. It certainly would be beneficial to the community if landlords know they've got tenants that are doing things that are illegal. I think most landlords try to do a good job and are trying to do it and when they have problems they are trying to work through the eviction process. Uh, but there are others that may not be doing that. Murphy says other measures need to be taken to make sure every corner of Holyoke is safe. And I know the chief has talked about that we could do community policing, but he needs more money. Uh, and I certainly think this is an area, if we're going to have a quality city, every neighborhood has to have quality. Especially, he says, for children. We're trying to make that child have a safe life, have a quality education. Kids going to Lawrence School having concerns about safety. I mean, those are the kind of things we have to deal with. We have to deal with them from a legal standpoint. We reached out to Holyoke Public Schools to see if they're going to be planning any kind of drug resistance program in their elementary schools in light of this situation. Reporting live in Springfield, Audrey Russo for Western Mass News.